hello and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Mia and today we're going to be talking about my September favorites. So I'm really excited to share some of my September favorites with you because these are more like things that I've loved over the whole year since this is my first favorites video on my channel. <laughs> so I'm going to start off with my skincare considering you know that's usually the first step of the routine so i just want to give a shout out to my favorite face wash this is by aveda it is the botanical kinetics purifying gel cleanser it's amazing it lasts for freaking ever you only need like two pumps and it has a really nice lather to it it is best for oily skin types Aveda does have another one that is a cream cleanser and that is better for people with drier skin types, but I really think this one would probably work for most everybody, but I love it. It's one of my favorites. So I have two products, well, three products here that I use. One is for like daytime and then the other one I use for slugging. I don't know if you've heard of the term, but I love slugging at night. I just love to lather my face in all the goodness and I like to use this Elemis, I think that's how you pronounce it, uh, Pro Collagen Night Cream. This is what it looks like. Um, so I got this in one of my FabFitFun boxes. If you've never tried FabFitFun, I would 100% recommend it. It is just the coolest. You can customize your boxes. It's really not too expensive and you get full size products, which is fantastic. Like wh what am I gonna do with a sample, you know? I wanna actually try it, see if I love it. And I actually really love this stuff and I'm going to have to try and find it um, somewhere and just purchase it or I can probably just buy it off of FabFitFun. When I use this, I take about, I would say a nickel size. Like I said, I like to slug my face. So I take about a nickel size of this and then I will put a few drops of my Josie Marin 100% pure argan oil and mix it together. The two of these things together is just, it's amazing. I look like an oily beast when I go to bed, but when I wake up, my skin is plump, it's juicy, it's just... If I had any blemishes, they were gone. I just, this is my tried and true combination and I've been using it all September. The item that I like to use during the day is the SkinCeuticals Daily Brightening UV Defense Sunscreen and it has SPF 30 in it. It just looks like this. I don't know if you've heard this or if you've heard it so many times, but SPF is the number one anti-aging anything right here and it brightens an even skin tone so i usually have like kind of like dark spots on my cheeks just from olivia i usually get dark spots on my cheeks if i've had like a breakout or something and i just left it alone it just my skin takes a long time to like heal and recover from that so when I use this, I definitely notice a really big difference on those spots. Get this. Put it on your face. Protect your skin. Even the skin tone. It's amazing. I just love it. I don't need too much of it. This has lasted me, you know, for about two to three months. And I use it every single day. Even if I don't put makeup on. Like I said, SPF is the best anti-aging anything that you can do. So the last product is a supplement and I have been taking this on and off for a few months and I stopped using it in the month of August because I just didn't refill it and it made the biggest difference in my skin. My skin like started getting dingy, I started breaking out, my hair wasn't growing as fast and my nails weren't nearly as strong and I've been taking it consistently in my coffee every single day um and it is the vital protein collagen creamer so 
I have a love-hate relationship with the creamer. I really don't like the taste of it. I don't like the consistency of it. Um, I don't find that it blends the greatest, but the way that I take it to kind of mask the things that I'm describing is I will put it into my coffee, blend it up with a little hand blender, and then I put a ton of whipped cream on top of mine, and it kind of masks the flavor and texture in the beginning, and then by the time the whipped cream is melted, it's, you can just go ahead and drink it. You've gotten used to it. Um, so this is the vanilla one. I do like the other bottle that is white with the blue lid. That one has no flavor to it and you can add that into just about anything and you won't notice it's in there. But I have noticed that this one has made the biggest difference in my skin, my hair, my nails, literally everything. My skin is just so much more even toned. My nails are just so much stronger. I have nothing on my nails, nothing. And they're strong and they're even. And I used to have the worst nails ever, like paper thin. Um, so yeah, and like when I take it, my hair grows so fast and you can clearly see I need to get my hair done. But now let's go ahead and move on to makeup. For makeup, I'm gonna be talking about two brands only two and these two brands have changed my life forever and I don't think I will really try to you know explore anymore because I just I'm here for it I freaking love these two brands and they are Rare Beauty and Merit so we'll go ahead and talk about Rare Beauty first I, I mean the packaging for them they're just so freaking cute I love them um, I love the applicator for, for the foundation. You just give it a little shake and then it has like a, I don't even know what you would call this. It looks like a lipstick, like a lip gloss type of applicator, but I love it to apply it to my face. I can, you know, make it as light coverage or as full coverage as I want. Um, as you can see, I'm hitting pretty close to pan on my concealer, but I love this concealer. I use it for brightening as well as concealing. Um, I love the consistency of it. It's pretty thick and I love it for the inside corners. It doesn't crease if I use like a setting powder, but that's just me with any sort of concealer. So it doesn't matter if I, if it's Rare Beauty, if it's Maybelline, whatever. Um, I always have to use a setting powder, but this I love. And then this blush is so amazing. I used to never use like cream blushes or, you know, like a liquid blush before. Now I don't think I can go back. I've tried to use like a powder before and it just, I don't get the same result. I feel like it looks like my skin is glowing and warm and it looks natural to me. It, it, to me, it looks very natural. Um, so when I use this, I literally will take this. It's like a very similar applicator to uh, the other, the um, foundation. So once I do that, I will literally wipe off the product so there's like nothing on there and just do a dot on my cheek a dot on this cheek and I will take the a brush and just lightly blend it and it just like soaks into the skin it's just so beautiful and effortless and I just I'm here for it I'm gonna have to get every single color if they ever come out with like an orangey, like a burnt orange, I'm here for it. Mm -hmm. I'm here for it. I'm moving on to Merit. So the things that I use for Merit is the contour stick. Well, I, I call it a contour stick. It is actually just um, their foundation stick, but I use it in like a really dark shade so that I can use it as my contour. And it goes on super creamy. I just kind of go around my perimeter and around my cheekbones and then it just blends out so seamlessly. I also use their um, highlighter and it's a cream highlighter. I'm all about their cream products. 
Like I don't know if I will ever go back to powder anything for my face besides like eyeshadow and stuff like that. Um, but this one is in the color Citrine and it's really, really nice. You can just, you just use your finger and you warm up the product with your warmth and it's just so gorgeous. Just so pretty. I love it. It's just the perfect natural color for me. Um, and it lasts all day. And again, it just has a really natural look to it. And then lastly, it is what I have on my lips and it is their lip oil. I think that's what it's called. This one is in the color taupe and it is like my lips, but better. Like I just, I can use this by itself. I, today I have it on with like a lip liner um, you can put it on top of a lipstick. Um, I just love it. And this is what it looks like. I probably just got it all like crazy looking, but that is it for my makeup. I've been really excited to talk about those because I want everyone to try them because they are just so beautiful. It's beautiful on the skin. It just makes everyone glow. I get so many compliments at work when I wear this combination. So many. Okay, so let's go ahead and move on to hair care. I'm gonna talk about only two products. One is really new to me, and then the other is like tried and true. I use it for everything. The first product that I wanna talk about is by Aveda. It is called the Rinseless Refresh. This is what it looks like. <clears throat> it is a hair and scalp refresher. So what I love to do with this product is on second day curly hair, I will go ahead and give myself a little spritz. I will lightly run my hand down and then I will scrunch the, the product back up into the hair. I'm really hoping this is giving so much justice because you don't need too much and it just adds so much more curl and definition and shine back into your hair. It's so soft. When it dries, like it's soft to the touch when it dries, it doesn't feel crunchy, it doesn't feel like anything. And what's cool about this, so it has micellar technology in it. So what that means is that when you spray the product onto the hair, the way it works is it will remove the dirt and evaporate the dirt, but the water molecule will stay in the hair and keep the hair nice and hydrated and moisturized. And I believe that to a T because the way that my hair feels after I use it. It doesn't feel crunchy. It doesn't feel like there's product on it anymore. It feels nice and clean and refreshed. So that is one of my absolute favorites. This is another product, but this one is new to me. It is by It's a 10 and it is coily. Guys, I didn't even know that they made products for curly hair. So I was like, you know what, let me just try this because I like their um, keratin one. And I was like, maybe I could try something for my curls and just see what it does. Guys, I literally need nothing else but this in my hair. It keeps the frizz away. It keeps my curls bouncy and hydrated and what? Like, why have, why have I been sleeping under a rock and not knowing about this? I really hope that you knew about this and I'm last to know because it's so good. So, uh, the 10 things it does instantly, it's a lightweight formula for curly or straight styles. I don't know if I would, I don't know. I mean, I guess I could try it. Um, defrizzes and tames flyaways, which it 100% did. It defines curls, which it 100% did. Uh, fortifies and protects from damage, which I love. I live in Florida, so, you know, the sun down here is just on 10. It is on 10. Um, it improves ease of combing. I don't comb my hair when I get out of the shower, so I can't, I don't know. Uh, moisturizes and enhances body. Yes. Um, manages natural volume. Yes. Helps reduce breakage and non-greasy. I can attest to all of these and it absolutely 100% does everything that it says. 
The only thing that I thought was weird with this was the spray. It comes out really strong and it's not like a nice mist. It's kind of like a direct, very direct centered. So you may want to brush it through, but what I did, I found that I loved it and this is going to be one of my new Holy Grail products for sure. Okay, so next I want to talk about clothing and it's kind of like shout outs to these brands because they're bomb. They're amazing. Um, they're affordable. They are, you know, female owned. They are community empowering. Like they just are really good brands. Um, the first one I want to talk about is what I'm wearing today. <clears throat> Let me clear my throat for this. The brand is called Female Gang. Shout out to Female Gang. So one of my really good friends, Haley Hale, is the owner, co-owner. She has another partner named Lou and they are just bomb.com. I think I might have just shown my age with that, but... Their brand is called Female Gang. They're all about female empowerment and just, they're just a cool ass brand all together. Let me show you the back. So, well, the front of this has really cute, like small little cutout details. Look how cute the back is, you guys. Look at this. It is so cute. Like, is this not like everybody's multiple personalities you know like I have like my sexy sassy girl but then yet again I have like my streetwear like don't with me yeah and I'm here for this I am totally here for this they have other really cute items they have a glove a workout glove it is called the rock glove so this was like Haley's first creation it was her first little baby and it is the coolest glove I'll put a picture of it somewhere but um so basically it's a regular workout glove but on the left ring finger it has a slit in it so that you can put your freaking engagement ring through it like when a man starts walking up to you you say oh uh-uh Yes, I have gloves on, but you can still see my rock. <laughs> I love you, Haley. I love you. Um, but yeah, totally support local small business. Like, like I said, affordable, cute stuff, comfortable stuff. I got this on the biggest size so that I could just be so beyond comfortable when I wear it. And it's so cute. So thumbs up to female gang. The next product that I want to talk about or the next brand I want to talk about is Camo Fitness. And I, so I've been seeing Camo Fitness for a really long time. I purchased from them months ago, like probably a year ago. And I was really impressed with their product. And now they've just come out with a new uh, legging and short. It's called the EOS. It is the scrunch booty type of legging glute enhancing leggings and let me tell you I already have a curvy bottom like I was so resilient to jump on this bandwagon of the glute separation and I don't know I just didn't want to draw more attention to my already decent sized butt if that makes any sense so I finally caved um there's a girl that I follow on YouTube and Instagram and she's talked about it and she was like, you won't be sorry, you will not be sorry if you get these shorts or leggings. So I did. And I am obsessed. Currently I have on their Serenity leggings. These are their Serenity shorts. And you can already see like how flattering they are. Their glute seams are so on point, it is ridiculous, but I just love their buttery soft, super affordable, and it's just, the brand is awesome. Like I said, everything is so affordable. It's in like the $20 range of, I think it's all 20 some dollars, um, maybe 32. I'll put the prices and stuff on the screen, but 
I just, I'm here for it. I love their products. The quality is so on point. Let me grab you a pair of shorts, hold on. So I just showed you my black Serenity shorts. They also have the Serenity shorts in like prints. These are so cute. These make your butt look beautiful. And they don't, these don't even have the booty scrunch. These are a few of, this is one of the pairs of the EOS. So when I got this, I was like, oh, uh-uh, uh-uh. That is, mm -mm. but because they have like extra fabric in the glue area, it helps like disguise the seam. I, d I don't know how to explain it, but if you guys want a full review on these leggings, give this video a thumbs up. And then this is also the brown color. I mean, the colors of them are gorgeous as well. I mean, hello. Just has super subtle logoing. And then the booty scrunch. Yeah, I just love these. I love. So the last brand that I want to talk about, it's on Amazon and it is Ella ZHU. I don't know what the ZHU sounds like, if it's her last name or whatever, but I've been wearing these to work and I am a hairstylist at a salon that the dress code is basically black. So I've been finding things that are a little like, they have a little interest, they have a little edge, they have a little something to them because I, you know, wearing just plain black can get boring. So this Ella ZHU brand is amazing. She's got like geographic printed shirts. So this is the shirt that I just recently wore to work. It looks really big and boxy, but I promise you when it's on, it is so freaking cute. It is long enough to wear it as a dress, um, but like I said, when I wear it to work, I just want to be work appropriate, so I just wear it with like liquid leggings, you know? Um, so, so freaking cute, um, and, 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 it's got freaking pockets, like hello, how cute. The sleeves, like I said, I just wanted something that had a little bit of interest to it. The sleeves have interest. The girl is definitely interesting. And then the pockets, like what? When a girl finds pockets in a dress or a shirt, you, you've, you've made it, you know, you've made it. That is it for the majority of like items. So I do want to talk about two social media accounts that I've been loving i've been loving i've been addicted to it i have one of them i literally have been binging the whole thing and it is by a woman named niage it is a podcast called abundance hack amazing so if you're into chakras sound healing and just you know bettering yourself spiritually you need to go listen to this podcast I'm not even joking. So when I started listening to it, I was learning about chakras and she has individual podcasts on each individual chakra and they are so unbelievably detailed and educational and I just learned so much. And then for a while she was doing a solo episode and then she would do an interview episode and the interviews are so good as well she's amazing she's in the tampa bay area if you are into sound healing or have been intrigued with sound healing i would 100 percent go check out her studio bliss bar it's amazing i'm healed i'm not healed i am healing <laughs> and it is all due to the discovery of her brand her company it's amazing um i always recommend people go do her energy analysis first so you can kind of get an overall analysis of your chakras your energy your aura like if your organs are all in balance like she's got it all together it is amazing and Nyanjay, if you're watching this love you girl love you girl
The other influencer that I want to give a shout out to, a little love tap to, her name is Lynette Adkins, I believe. Adkins, Adkins. I will put her name on the screen um, and I will put it in the bottom bar. Everything, everything that I talked about today will be in the bottom bar. Um, but Lynette Adkins is also, she is on her own spiritual journey and I freaking love that she's so raw and real and you know she lets you in on her life and like her own spiritual journey so for me because I'm also on one it's been really helpful because then you don't feel like you're alone like you're going through this by yourself and feeling the way that you're feeling alone because she's also going through these feelings and then the people in her comments are so helpful and are also going through the same type of thing and it's just nice she's got a good community and yeah, so shout out to Lynette. I love your channel. Well, I think this video has been definitely long enough, um, but I want to just say thank you so much for sticking with me. And if you've made it this far, give me a little like sparkle emoji in the comments. And if you want to see a uh, camo fitness review, give this video a thumbs up. And Thank you so much for joining me and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.